Hi, this is Andrea Shulman again, and in today's quick Law of Attraction video, I want to talk about one of my favorite mottos on the Law of Attraction from my favorite teacher on the Law of Attraction, Abraham Hicks, and the motto is this, you never get it wrong and you never get it done. And this is such a powerful statement to really internalize, and I want to talk about why that is in today's video. But before that, if you are watching this video on YouTube or on my website, please make sure to subscribe because I do put out new Law of Attraction tips every week. Also, if you're watching this video on YouTube or Facebook, please make sure to turn on your notifications so that you actually see these videos when they come out, all right? But let's go ahead and get into talking about this motto of you never get it wrong and you never get it done. All right, I really love this statement from Abraham Hicks, and when I really got this one, it really shifted my perception entirely. Because a lot of people, when they come to the Law of Attraction, and I was no different, a lot of people, when they come to the Law of Attraction, one of the things that they're attempting to do is to get their life perfect. Thinking that, you know, I can use the Law of Attraction to make my life perfect, and then I can just be happy forever so I can get the perfect spouse, the perfect job, the perfect house, the perfect body, blah, 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 blah. And if I check off all these things on this list, my life's gonna be perfect, and that's that. But that's not really the way that things work. Because, why? Well, we're eternal creatures, we're eternal beings, and so we're always in the process of creating more and more and more. It is our nature. And that's not something that you can really take away. Think about it this way. Let's say that you want to attract a great relationship. All right. And you want to use the law of attraction to attract this great relationship. Well, first of all, that's not all done at once. It's something that's done in a process. And so to think of it in terms of totality, if you were to just suddenly arrive in the place where you had this perfect relationship and that was that, well, you're gonna miss out on all the fun, first of all. You're gonna miss out on the flirting, you're gonna miss out on the dating, you're gonna miss out on the courting and all of that kind of stuff. That's one thing. The other thing to understand is that nothing is static. Everything changes, things are dynamic. And so you could perfectly well attract your soulmate but that doesn't mean that you're done with the relationship. You don't just get to mail it in from here until forever. You know, you're gonna find that soulmate, but then maybe you wanna start dating them. And then you start dating and then maybe you wanna get married. And then maybe you get married and well, maybe now we want kids or maybe now we wanna build our empire together. A relationship is something that's gonna change over time. And so no matter where you are in life, you are gonna be thinking about how could I make this better? How could this be more fun? And so that's one thing to understand, you never get it done. Doesn't matter if it's a job, your body, a relationship, anything. It's dynamic. It's gonna be something that you continue to invest in over time. Now, the other thing to understand about this statement is that you never get it wrong. And a lot of times people are really worried that they're gonna manifest something and that's it, their life is screwed, it's all over for them. But that's not the way that it works at all. No matter what you manifest in life, you just find yourself in a new paradigm capable of turning it into something else. And actually, the times where you really fall on your butt and mess things up the most are actually end up being the times of your greatest growth usually. I don't know if you've noticed that, but the times that you've really fallen back behind and screwed up in life, are the times where you've really gotten a lot of clarity on what it is that you want from life. And a lot of times when you find the motivation to really go after your dreams. And so it doesn't matter where you land in reality. It doesn't matter at all because you always have the capacity to change it and to mold it with the law of attraction. And if things were just perfect and fantastic all the time, there'd be nothing for you to change, nothing for you to create, nothing for you to do. You'd just be sitting in this perfect state of not having to do anything. And wouldn't that be really boring? Like, wouldn't that just lose the fun out of it altogether? Because ultimately, at the end of the day, we are creators. That's what we're here to do. We're not just here to just sit in a blissful state. We're here to look at what is and to make it better. That's our job. That's what brings us joy. So remember that. 
You never get it done. You never get it wrong. You're on an eternal journey and that's a good thing. Look at it as just going from one adventure to the next. That's really all that's happening here. As soon as, soon as you can get into that mindset, you're gonna let go of that idea of having to make it perfect because having to make it perfect just means that you got it done. And do you really wanna get it done? Or do you wanna live life and continue to make it better and more fun for yourself and for the world? Thanks for watching this video on the Law of Attraction. Again, please make sure to subscribe and to turn on your notifications. And of course, please have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.